F. Scott Fitzgerald once said, the world only exists in your eyes, your conception of it. You can make it as big or as small as you want to. Now I came into this world a pretty little guy, as many of us do, and I also grew up in a small town, a speck amidst an immense world. I was raised in paradise and went to a small school nestled high in the Colorado Rockies. A community at the end of the highway, the edge of the world, full to the brim with majestic beauty, but small in almost every other way. Now being raised in such a small town makes the world seem big and exciting. This big world makes me feel small, insignificant. However, as I get older, I achieve increasingly bigger things. I never thought I'd be big enough to make the varsity hockey team, to compete in a state championship bike race, or to create my own film company, but I grew to the challenges and conquered them. This little town taught me that the capacity of one's character and the magnitude of their passion far outweighs their physical size and abilities. This shows me that being small isn't a bad thing. It means I'm never too big to lend some of my time. It also broadens horizons of opportunity unavailable to all those small world people out there. Who wants to live confined in a small world with nowhere new to explore, no mountains to summit, or challenges to overcome? While a small world may be simpler, interpreting the complexities of the wider world and overcoming the adversities it presents is captivating. So yes, the world is big, but it is also tremendously beautiful, exciting, and full of opportunities. A big world equates with big experiences, big challenges. And while I may be small now, I know that my life is all about perspective, that I am already broadening my horizons to do big things that I had previously thought were impossible. Norman McLean wrote, one of life's quiet excitements is to stand somewhat apart from yourself and watch yourself softly becoming the author of something beautiful. I may be small, the world may be big, but regardless of size, I know I'm ready to do big things, to become the author of my own beautiful future.